Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how you can convert your certificate and key file to pfx format and also how to import that pfx in IIS web server. As you know, import pfx SSL certificate is easiest way to import in IIS. Okay, let's start. As you can see here, this is my IIS server and I have one website and its name is cinealign.net. This is server certificate and it's MPT now. After import our certificate to IIS, it will appear here. These are certificate files. Bundle.pem is our bundle certificate. That's not necessary. Certificate.pem and key.key .key is our cert and key file. When you order certificate, you will receive these files from your certificate provider. I will export pfx file from these files. At first, we have to download OpenSSL. OpenSSL has a Windows and Linux versions, but because we are using Windows now, we try to download it for Windows. Open this website. Download OpenSSL Lite version. You can download exe file. Open downloaded file, run, click on yes to download required windows component, click on run. Install Close Next 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 Install You can donate this application Finish. Open directory of installed OpenSSL. Open bin folder. OpenSSL.exe is here. Open CMD from here. Copy certificates file to bin folder. Now convert certificate and key to pfx by using this command. You can find these commands in the comments.
See now line.pfx is our output pfx file. Certificate.pem is your certificate, key.key .key is your private key. Scene online is your pfx file password. It will be used when you import pfx file. Ok, pfx file generated. Open IIS. Click on server. Click on server certificate. From right menu click on import. I exported it to OpenSSL bin directory. Select your exported PFX certificate. Write your PFX password. Select web hosting as a certificate store. OK. As you can see, seen online certificate imported to IS. Now click on website. Click on bindings, add, select HTTPS as a type, now you can select imported certificate from the list. You can review your certificate by click on view. That's correct. Okay. Okay. That's it. You can encrypt your HTTPS traffic for this website by using imported certificate. I hope this video was useful for system administrators to import certificate of websites to their web servers. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and watch another video. Don't forget to like the video and ask your questions in the comments. Have a good day. Bye bye.